Well, a typical day in the life of a superintendent is not really typical. You never know from one day to the next what's going to pop up. Of course, you always have things on your calendar that you need to address. So many of the things that I would consider routine would be perhaps meeting with staff, some school visits, not as many of those as I would love to be able to do because there's so much going on in a system this size. So I try to schedule one or two of those a week. Sometimes that schedule gets messed up because of other pressing issues. Of course, you deal with school board members and issues that are coming through the school board. Every day, there are just so many things that happen. Textbooks, uh, buses, transportation, CNP, child nutrition kind of things. It's like a small city. And when you have 30,000 students, 4,000 employees, and every student has a parent, so you multiply that out, and all of a sudden you're dealing with maybe just routinely the possibility of 100,000 people or more on a day-to-day -day basis. A typical day is being able to do what I call dance between raindrops because you never know exactly what's going to happen, but you have to be prepared to deal with it. You know, we have to do work with communities, we have to work, meet with the chamber, meet with the mayor, meet with local uh, community groups. I uh, haven't been in lots of different roles as an educator, from a teacher all the way to being a superintendent and in between the principal. And, director of curriculum and things like that, kind of have an eye for what's going on in the school when I walk in the building. And I see a lot of really, 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 really good things and then I see some things maybe that we need to work on. So I try to take time to reflect with a principal about some things. My favorite part of being a superintendent? Uh, I would say it has to be that I can help make things work for students because that's the biggest part of why we exist as a school district. We are here to help educate students. And our students are so diverse in their lives, their history, their socioeconomic status, the experiences they've had, their talents. So I enjoy being able to go out and, and just see from pre-K all the way up to high school, what's going on with our students, how they're making it, what are we doing to give them everything that we can possibly give them as a school system?